we gather parts from all over the world and uh, bring them to our shop in Connecticut where we do all the final assembly and testing and, and, and ear testing on the microphones. Um, I can start with a head amplifier which is uh, employed in the SA538B and SA538. The um, polypropylene and metallized polyester film capacitors come from the US. Uh, the uh, filter capacitors from Japan, uh, the electrolytics, and the high value resistors from China. We get the circuit card from China and we do all the final assembly on the circuit card then in our shop. Uh, I wire all the capsules using Teflon coated silver plated wiring as you can see which are carefully hand braided to reject noise. Uh, all of our uh, brass castings and metalwork come from China and then we do all the finish machining, plating, uh, the black coating and the laser engraving is, are, uh, are all done by local subcontractors in Connecticut. Uh, so the, the product is, uh, and the, I'm sorry, the vacuum tubes come from the Slovak Republic and output transformer, which you can see around here. I don't know if you can see on, on the camera, but that also comes from the U.S. Um, the product uh, winds up being a uh, product which is made in the United States, but with global materials. So it's, I think, quite a unique process uh, compared to some of the other microphone manufacturers. Uh, right now, we make five products. Uh, three of them have vacuum tube head amplifiers. The SA538B, which has a 1.07 inch uh, side terminated capsule. The SA538, which has a 1.06 inch center terminated capsule. The presence peaks in both microphones are placed at different areas to uh, give a, a different and distinctive sound. Uh, the E700 has a 1.22 inch center terminated capsule and this is a solid state uh, microphone with pure class A head amp electronics. The M900, which is sold with all three capsules, cardioid figure eight and, om I mean, sorry, cardioid omni and uh, hypercardioid, um, uh, is also solid state. The S600, which is a very unique microphone in that it has a uh, one inch diaphragm and it is a front, front loaded, the, you know, it's a front address microphone. It's an excellent microphone uh, over the drum set and in the room. Uh, this is sold only in matched stereo pairs. The M900 can be ordered in a matched stereo pair. Um, the other product that we're showing here at the show is our PF1 pop, uh, proprietary pop filter. And uh, you can see that uh, over there on the demo uh, microphones. And the, uh, the thing that makes that, this pop filter very unique and, and makes it outperform other nylon pop filters is that we use a fiber made by a company called Sawtetech, which is called High Phobe Acoustics. And what it does is it uh, is more effective in repelling moisture than any nylon pop filter. Nylon pop filters tend to hold on to the moisture and then they compromise your frequency response. So uh, by that, the, uh, the pop filter uh, performs better than any nylon pop filter. The other aspect of the pop filter which is very good is that it uh, fits to the microphone with a simple Velcro strap. So not only will it fit all of our large diaphragm side address microphones, it will fit mostly any other uh, large diaphragm side address microphone, your uh, you know, U87, U47, U67, etc.